Welcome. Today I want to introduce the documentary pack from Optical Overlays. This documentary pack is great for filmmakers, editors, and photographers. This pack has over 160 PNG files offered in 8K or 2K resolutions, perfect for anything to do with talent, like weddings, interviews, portraits, studio work, etc. We've got some great clips from Pond5.com. We're working in Adobe Premiere, though we also have tutorials for Final Cut and Adobe Photoshop. What's unique about this pack is that we'll work with any photo or video editing software. Every one of these PNG files is transparent in the middle. We do that so that it doesn't cover up any of your talent. Let's take a look at some of the footage I have here. So I got this guy doing an interview. Great. I want to give it more of a documentary feel. So I'm going to find one of these to play with, like this one. Drag and drop this right on top. And again, the unique quality of this, these are PNGs, so they can be as long or as short as you want them to be. Now, as I'm playing it, notice how there's nothing. Well, these are very, very large files, so we need to scale them down a little bit. So I'm going to go to my motion set here, and I'm going to scale it down. Notice how it's coming into view there. I think that's about good. And then we also need to make it more transparent. So I'm going to take my blend mode and make it screen. It takes the black and makes it transparent. Now I've got an excellent look to my documentary. Let's try another one of these. So I'm going to delete this one. I'm going to go back. And let's find another one that suits what, we, what we're looking for here. Here we go. Drag and drop it right on top there. Minimize this. Increase the size of this. And we also need to scale this one back. Because remember, these are very large files we're dealing with. And we'll make the blend mode screen. Looks fantastic. So let's take a look at another example. We've all tried the other company's lens flares and video effects. The challenge is, the effect doesn't work well when the camera's stationary. So I've got this other company's lens flare here. We can see that it's pretty cool. We'll have to change the blend mode here. Let's see what it looks like when I've got footage that is stationary. Not quite the feel I'm looking for. Ours are stationary. They're PNG files, not moving images. Let's take a look at one of ours again. Let's come back a little bit. This one looks perfect. Let's try to use this. So again, we're going to stretch this out, change our scale and our blend mode. I think I know which one. Let's just do 23. Perfect. Change our blend mode again. And looks this looks awesome. But I want to change it even further. Let's add an effect. Let's add a tint effect. Because I want to tint it a different color. So we're going to drag that here. And back in my effects control, now I can change the tint. I can change it red. Now my documentary is going to take a completely different turn. Or I can map it with the color to a specific point in my video. I grab my eyedropper here, and I'm going to click on her skin tone. It makes this effect look like it belongs. All of these give your footage that documentary feel almost instantly, effortlessly. For more information on these effects, go to opticaloverlays.com. If you want to try some of this on your own footage, we offer free 5K download. See where your imagination can take you, and thanks again for watching.